Nolagent here, and in this episode, R and O's. Welcome to Nolagent. Let the good times roll. I've been eating at R and O's for many years, and I'm a big fan. R and O's is located in the neighborhood known as Bucktown, right at Lake Pontchartrain on the lakefront. You can't really see the lake though because it's behind levees and some pump stations. Well, let's go on inside. Now this footage was taken before the COVID-19 pandemic during the peak of carnival time when this place was packed as this is a very popular restaurant with everybody in the area. And it's because they have really great food that uh, is such a wide variety that it can satisfy almost everybody. They have pizza for children and then just fantastic New Orleans local food of po' boys, gumbo, and pastas and all sorts of wonderful items that we'll review here in a little bit. But uh, as you look around, you can see all the carnival decorations that are still up here. And uh, Arno's is definitely not a fancy place, but it makes up for that with great food. It's definitely more of your dive category type place, but it is always popular. And uh, you can often end up waiting for a table if you don't get here at the right time. So we're gonna be uh, seated back here next to the bar. And you can see they have a few fish right here. And so as we see our waitresses with their r and shirts, that's always nice to see. It makes me a little hungry just seeing the waitresses and we're gonna get our order taken here. So let's get ready to take a look at the menu and see what we can get. Appetizers, we have French fries with brown gravy, cheese French fries, garlic bread with mozzarella added, hot tamale balls, Hush puppies, potato salad, fried sweet potatoes, raw fish pie, crab claws fried, stuffed artichoke, shrimp remoulade, barbecued shrimp, jalapeno stuffed crab poppers, boiled shrimp, boiled crawfish, crab pie, onion rings, eggplant with red sauce, fried oyster appetizer, Seafood gumbo, oyster soup, vegetable with beef, salads, shrimp salad, large or small, Italian toss salad, large and small, you can add olives, artichoke hearts and lettuce with Italian dressing, lettuce and tomatoes with Italian dressing, lettuce with Italian dressing, grilled chicken salad, and specialty sandwiches. Arno special ham and roast beef with Swiss cheese, roast beef, Italian roast beef, Italian combo, meatball Italian sausage with red gravy and cheese, muffalata, french fries with brown gravy, and then more sandwiches. And these are po' boys still, so ham, ham and cheese, hot sausage, hamburger or on a bun, grilled chicken, grilled tuna, smoked turkey breast, shrimp, Oyster, fish, stuffed crab, meatball with mozzarella, Italian sausage, dill parmesan, chicken parmesan, soft shell crab, soft shell crab parmesan, stuffed crab parmesan, eggplant parmesan. And you uh, dress in New Orleans means you add lettuce, tomatoes, mayo, and pickles. Uh, then you can also add butter or cheese. Then we have our lunch specials, Monday through Friday till 3 p.m. Roland Junior Seafood Stew with rice or pasta. Added a few times, that's pretty good. Spaghetti and sauce, meatball and spaghetti, lasagna, always a great lunch uh, selection. I like their lasagna. Italian sausage, eggplant parmesan with mozzarella and pasta, veal parmesan with mozzarella and pasta, chicken parmesan with mozzarella and pasta. Then we have pizzas and individual, medium, and large sizes with a selection of thin crust or thick crust with a wide variety of toppings here. Uh, cheese, pepperoni, Italian sausage, onion, meatball, green pepper, smoked bacon, salami, mushrooms, Canadian bacon, black olives, fresh tomatoes, chopped garlic, anchovies, jalapeno peppers, sliced turkey, and shrimp and artichoke parts. On the other side of the menu, we have dinners 
Roll in seafood stew with rice or pasta, seafood platter, shrimp, oysters, fish, french fries with stuffed crab, with soft shell crab, stuffed crab parmesan, soft shell crab parmesan, veal parmesan, chicken parmesan, stuffed crab plate, two crabs, shrimp plate, oyster plate, fish plate, soft shell crab plate, two crabs, lasagna, meatballs and spaghetti, Italian sausage and spaghetti, spaghetti and sauce, meat, grilled chicken with red gravy and pasta, eggplant parmesan with mozzarella and pasta, grilled tuna with red gravy and pasta, fettuccine sauce over angel hair pasta, shrimp fettuccine over angel hair pasta, grilled chicken fettuccine, grilled tuna fettuccine, and you can substitute sweet fries or potato salad. And children's plates, shrimp with french fries, stuffed crab, one crab, meatball, one, and spaghetti, fish with french fries, oysters with french fries, soft shell crab, one crab, with french fries, fried chicken breast with french fries, spaghetti and sauce, meat, grilled chicken with red gravy and pasta, substitute sweet fries or potato salad, burger patty with french fries, desserts, hot bread pudding with rum sauce, specialty pies, and then we have our beverages. So you've got your normal coffee, tea, and your uh, carbonated beverages of uh, Parks and Coke products, and then milk, fruit juices, and then spirits with the alcohol, and some different selections of nice mixed drinks and beers. Well, I always get the seafood gumbo because it is a fantastic rendition and one of the best uh, gumbos I've ever had. They vary it up pretty often with crabs and other things depending on the season and it's always delicious and well flavored and spiced but of course I always add a little dash of Tabasco in it to give it a little extra kick. Click uh, thumbs up if you like to a little Tabasco or other hot sauce in your gumbo too or click uh, thumbs down if you don't. This gumbo is fantastic, and I get it 99.9% .9 of the time, and it is just such a great flavor profile. It is so, so delicious every time. It's actually my mom's favorite gumbo, so that is uh, quite a lot there. She doesn't like to eat it anywhere else often because all she wants to do is go here to have the gumbo. So I have eaten this for many, many visits to Rino's. I'm a big fan. It's got lots of good stuff in there and they're usually chock full of shrimp, a lot of crawfish, some oysters sometimes, lots of crab. So it's great stuff that I always finish down to the last drop as you can see here. Okay, we're going to do a little jump in time forward to during the pandemic when Rino's had first reopened. Uh, this is the Italian salad with olives. It used to be called the WAP salad. They changed that because too many tourists were getting their feelings hurt, even though the Sicilian people in the area named the salad themselves. So I guess people from Sicily and Italy can't name a salad the way they want to uh, these days. We will see. But it is a delicious salad. Good stuff. Um, this is a small here. So small is definitely enough for several people. And you might have noticed the big change uh, in my beard before the pandemic and after. So just comment below if you like your Nola Gent with or without the big beard. Ho ho ho! Alright, here's my po boy. And this is just the half. I got the Italian roast beef dressed with mozzarella cheese and added Creole mustard to it. And this is the whole version of the same sandwich, and it makes more sense really to get the whole because it only costs a little bit more. This is my favorite po' boy here generally, so I get this pretty often. <laughs> and RNO's does often get rated as the best roast beef po' boy in New Orleans. That amazing crunchy sound of the bread. <laughs> They do toast the bread and it's quite delicious. All right, look at my hands already getting dirty here. And uh, we're going for the second half. It's a big, huge sandwich. It's a big meal to eat this whole thing. All right, look at my hands. In New Orleans, we have a rating scale based on the number of napkins it takes to clean up after your po' boy. 
this is a big stack of napkins to clean up after. Plus, look at this whole extra meal I still have of roast beef and other things that fell out of the po' boy. Now here's my stack of napkins. It was about a, a six napkin po' boy. Then the meatball po' boy is also quite tasty. So this is back during the pandemic times. Oh, the meatball po' boy is pretty good. Oh, oh, oh. Now the seafood po' boys are also fantastic. So you can't go wrong with those. Now we're gonna have some cheese fries. So look at here, this cheese is all nice and uh, gooey the way we like it. The fried eggplant appetizer is also a fantastic item to get. The fried oyster appetizer is delicious, as is the fried shrimp appetizer. So the fried seafood is definitely a winner here. And then a soft shell crab parmesan, amazing. Look at the size of that crab. Meatballs and spaghetti, always a nice choice. And then the tamales are also a fantastic option. For a while, they lost their tamale maker and they were having to do these uh, tamale ball items, but they finally got their tamale maker back and they're back to proper tamales as of now. So what do you think we have here? Jambalaya, crawfish pie, ah ha ha. It's a crawfish pie. They also have a crab pie that's fantastic. Uh, you should try both if you ever visit here and you haven't had them. They're both really delicious. Well, I hope you enjoyed your visit here to R&O's and uh, if you did, please uh, subscribe to the Nola Jet channel and click that thumbs up. Thanks for watching, I really appreciate it. And if you would just click on the little circle here with a picture of my head in there and subscribe to the Nola Jet channel, it would really help me a lot. I really appreciate it. Thank you.